Hey everyone, my name is B. Today we are remaking a video that I made last year, the Elgato fix. Um, not many people read the comments, but so I really want to remake the video and be really specific on how I did the fix. I no longer use the Elgato HD 60 S, but I still want to make the video for all the people that needed the help. And uh, yeah. So before we get started, I just also like to mention I stream on Twitch full time, um, Tuesday through Saturday. If you have any problems, you can come on by and I can walk you through step by step. Anyway, let's get right into it. So step one, you're going to want to actually plug it into a USB 3.0. The regular USB is usually black and it looks like that. And then the USB 3.0 is usually blue and it says SS USB 3.0 by it. So once you plug it in that, you're good to go. And then step one is complete. So step two, you're going to have to download the software to use the capture card. The Elgato software is Game Capture HD. You can get it from their website. I'll leave a link down below. Um, you freshly start your PC. With the capture card plugged into the 3.0 port and then you're going to go down to your search bar here you're going to type in device manager you go down to universal serial bus controllers you're going to go down to usb root hub in brackets 3.0 i have three on mine no matter how many there is on yours you're just going to want to do the same thing let's go to properties power management Allow this computer to turn off the device to save power. You're going to uncheck it and then press OK. Then you go back, do the exact same thing, and then check it. You're going to do that to all three of them. I don't need to do it because I no longer use this, this capture card. And then you're going to go down and restart your PC. And then that's step two done. All right, for step three, you start up your PC again and everything's plugged in and you just did the, the previous step and you're freshly started up and it's still not working. What you're gonna do is go to your Elgato capture card and just unplug the USB cord that's plugged into your PC. You're gonna unplug it really quickly Then you're going to plug it back in. With that, step three is done. After all those steps, your capture card should be working. Um, the only thing is before you start streaming, you're going to have to do these steps every single time. Disclaimer, this fix doesn't work for everybody. Some PCs are too old and they don't have a USB 3.0. You have to have a USB 3.0 to use this capture card. Another thing, when you are starting your US o OBS Studio or Streamlabs OBS, whatever software you're using to stream, when you're starting when you're starting it up, you right click it and run as an administrator. That's also another fix after you're done doing all these steps, and then you add running as an administrator it everything should work with that being said thank you guys so much for watching i appreciate it if you guys like this kind of content please like and subscribe until next time be out